Australia is poised to triple its gas production, but consumer advocates are warning this morning it could be bad news for households. The New South Wales Independent Pricing Authority is considering a 20% price hike as gas exports to Asia expose eastern states to international prices for the first time. Here's Consumer Affairs reporter Amy Bainbridge. Australians have long been encouraged to embrace gas. Our gas has always been cheap by world standards as everything produced has only been used domestically. That's about to change. Several new projects will produce gas just for the Asian market, where wholesale prices are more than double what's charged here. The skyrocketing demand in Asia means local prices will need to match them to protect supply. In a worst case scenario you can see gas prices moving from that sort of more recent four to five dollar a gigajoule range to look potentially ten, eleven dollars a gigajoule, so virtually a doubling at the wholesale level. And a higher wholesale price means a bigger household bill. Our best guess is around twenty percent price increase. Modelling by St Vincent de Paul shows ACT households will be hit the hardest, with gas bills expected to go up three hundred dollars a year. In Victoria, it will be $270, $200 in New South Wales and South Australia and $140 in Queensland. Western Australia, the Northern Territory and Tasmania won't be affected. Hi Mary, sorry to keep you waiting. This busy community centre in Melbourne's outer suburbs offers everything from financial counselling to emergency help to pay bills and buy food. So there is a utility relief grant available. It's going to cause a lot more stress than um, there is at the moment. Um, it's hard to imagine um, what other sacrifices people are going to have to make because already we're seeing people struggling. Simon Coyle is on a disability pension and lives in community housing and paying more for gas will be hard on his household budget. Any increase in costs is just going to be a juggling game. Do I get high quality food that I need to keep myself healthy or do I go for the cheap stuff? People seeking emergency relief to help pay their utilities bills is on the rise with electricity prices more than doubling in the past decade. If, as expected, gas prices follow suit, choosing more efficient home appliances will become critical. Government can provide consumers with more information about the likely costs of appliances over the course of their lifespan. So not just the upfront cost but also the fuel costs so that consumers can make the choices between different types of energy. But they say challenges remain for people on low incomes or those who rent and more research needs to be done so people can decide what's best for them long term. Amy Bainbridge, ABC News.